Okay, folks, today we'll be doing something a little different. I went out to catch some fall perch with my buddy. You guys can check out his Instagram, South Jersey Bassin. This was basically a casual day out. With that said, you'll see some cuts of videos of us catching some fish. I was basically using a 1 16th ounce jig head with a Euro Tackle B Vibe swim bait, and I was slaying it. The water temperature was approximately high 40s. Perch are cold water species, so they'll be biting all winter long. I'm using my BFS setup here. The reel is the Surinoir Spare Fox with a shallow spool. This allows me to cast very light lures. And I'm using my Dexterity Rod C632UL. This is an awesome bait casting rod. Right, this is my favorite spot area for for perch for sure. It's here. Okay. Once we got back a little bit deeper edge. And the wind is blowing this way too, up into the creeks. No, what? Dude. Told you, dude. Dude. Told you. Told you. Look, Look at you. Look at Yep. We're in a channel. So oh, we got the K-Tech. It's a little, I don't know if it's a little bit fatter, but. All right. Getting them. The nine, 10 inches, let's go. Mm -hmm. I did really good. Oh yeah. yeah. Got another one right there, man. Yep, another one right there. He's a jumbo. Oh, that's a jumbo. Indeed. Look at that. Gotta love this. the clear water, watching all the way down there. Yep, and I love the fall fins. Look at that orange in the edge. Look at that. Look at this. Like, look, 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 look at that. Double fin. it up. <laughs> Double it up. All right. Random. Oh, it's not as good though. It's all right. Sure, that big bait. Let me turn around. Take a look. Oh yeah. Look at that. A little bit bigger swim bait. <laughs> yeah, you got a three inch right there. Three inch K Tech. Nice. Yep. I was like, I need to. Oh, got one. There, there's a bass. Dude. Right. I'm about to hold like my purse right next to it and see which one's longer. Right. Wondering when he's gonna show himself. There he goes. Look at those patterns. Sweet. But yeah, this uh, this one side usually I produce most of my bass in a hot temperature. All right, so um, next to the basket, but not in the basket, I <laughs> get in trouble. Um, given that there's a tree here. There we go. Oh, got him! Pow! There he is. Yep. Oh, that's a good one. Yes, sir. All right, look at that. Right. Probably the biggest one so far. Could be. Look at that. Let me just look at his belly for a second, guys. The belly is not that big yet. I know in like December they get really big because they start stacking up those, uh, uh, storing those uh, eggs up for early March. Ooh, off like a rocket. Nice, there you go. And white rod these sure fun. Nice, thick. Very nice. Gotta love them. Thank you. Now we start playing basketball. <laughs> <laughs> catch a limit little type of bag of her crappy and sunny is like what we're doing right now i can't tell you how many times we've tried doing this to target them uh -huh. it never works it's just me okay? <laughs> it's it's my style i i kind of got the gist so well whatever your your <laughs> juju is it is working because this don't happen to me every day <laughs> <laughs> like i said the only basically the only other way i catch these yellows and stuff is on the jerk bait and the, the trap. I just have, I don't have much confidence with this. Yeah, I was bouncing up bottom when I was re retrieving. He came up and he turned around. <laughs> this one out here. Let the wind carry us. Mm -hmm. But yeah, this the, the soft plastic is always going to work better. But you know, you just feel like the other ones. That's that's what you use, typically use, right? But uh, man, these soft plastics, they're great. Love it. Look at that. Oh, colors. Colors. I know, man. Daddy. Here we go. That's what I'm talking about. 
And this is what I'm talking about. <laughs> I can never get over them. Especially the fin. This fin right here. I'm gonna actually change up color heads. Just to, Just to see what's going on. Just to experiment. Maybe I'll Bam! Get them. What? Small yeah. guy. Right at the bottom. What color? Chartreuse. Chartreuse head. Right, Chartreuse head. What about yellowish with pink? I think they'll like it. I mean, look at look at the body for a second. Put it right next to them. They will compete against each other, right? Fish eat fish. Oh, yeah. So, give it a shot, man. Um, I ended up buying a block and a half of ice from the tackle shop. <laughs> Eight bucks. Good. Block of ice to see aisle. A block of ice. Dude. Like. It's all big. It's like you want a small one or a big one. I got the big one. And the big one is a box. It lasted. It stayed in my in my cooler for over was it like three or four days. Uh huh. Hey. Oh yeah. That's a thick one. Right at that point. Look at you go. Look at him. Look oh, at him. Yeah. Look at him. Oh yeah. Biggest one of the day probably. Now that <laughs> Keep saying that. They're slowly getting bigger by like milli ounces. Dude. There we go. Look at that. That's basket's full. God. I hate looking up like this. It's gonna snap. <laughs> How bad is that tree? It's bent. <laughs> <laughs> it's like someone's fishing for you. Look at that. <laughs> Bamboo rod. Ready? Yep. Sling it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, Do I have to extend it? Ah, oh. oh, son of a <laughs> sea biscuit. The fish turned the other way. Right. Fish on. Yeah. Let him go. Look at him go. Nope. Another perch. Oh yeah. Fat. The crap is getting better size. Huh? Yeah, because it's, it's a bigger lure. I'm darting it around. I'm still touching the bottom. Great lure for any sort of pan fishing right here. I mean, it's relatively large too. Yeah. That was good. Look at this. It's a good profile too. Big fat belly type of minnows. Hook of these right here. Ultralight fishing, very fun. Time to do some cooking. <laughs> 